Uh, hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. I am Joby B3 from Joby B3 Games, and uh, thank you for joining me today. We're out here at my witch farm, my witch farm base, and uh, I just love this place. But uh, let's go see what we're going to get into today. Whoops. All right. Um, I've done a little bit of work. Not much, just a little bit off camera. I, uh... Down here, you'll you'll know. Uh, let's see. You just dug a little bit more of the hallway, and uh, and you know, uh, I, I went out and got some cows and brought them back here and stuck them back here for safekeeping. I plan on making a cow farm because I need the leather, and uh, you know, uh, beef would be nice too. But what I mostly did was this. I dug out a huge area back here, and it's not even a huge area. It's just a big area, but. It needs to be bigger. It needs to be a lot bigger. Um, it needs to be at least twice as long that way as it is that way. So that's a lot of digging. And one thing I've never done is use TNT to dig. So this could be a big disaster or it could be really, really cool. I don't know which it's going to be, um, but let's find out together, all right? So, dug a little hole here. Um, it's about, what, three back? Because uh, I seem to remember someone saying that it blows up in a five. What the hell? Let's go. Run! And... What did it do? What did it do? Um, that's not much damage. It's like a, what, a 3x3 three three inside a wall? Hmm. A 3x3. Three three. What happens, say, if we do it this way? Um, let's see. This will save on picks. 3x3... Three I don't know. Actually, I don't know if it's a 3x3 three three isn't much. I would have to put them like one, two. I would have to put them like every other block. Ugh. So, what happens if we do this? We say go back like this. All right, so that's a few back. And then we take a block. Let's go disrupt some blocks here. All right, and we not place one there. We want to place it here. And then every other one. So that would be three here. here every third one. Let's try every third one. Let's see what happens. Maybe they'll light each other up. Every third one. Um, live and learn. Live and learn. Uh, well, it did some did some work. Let's see where. Oh, I don't have any torches. Oh no. That was pretty good. Um, but I don't have any torches. Mm, Alright, so we're going to have to have our bow. Uh, which I've got. Go grab some torches real quick, just in case. I don't have any torches. Wonderful. Wonderful. But I do have... This and this. So I can do... This. And this. All right, so now I got some torches. Anybody in there? Hello? Nope, nobody's home. Good. I didn't think it'd be far enough away to spawn, but, you know, what the heck. So. Um, yeah. That's pretty cool. Now I just need to come up with a pattern. And I can get a huge bunch of this done. Um... Hmm. 
Let's see. Does it go all the way to the ceiling here? Yeah, well, I mean, it'll be a lot less. It'll be a lot less digging. Uh, I'm going to make up some TNT. And uh, I'm going to dig into some walls here. Um, I don't know how many I've got to go back. I know we've got to go back even further than that. I, I didn't dig all the way back. So this is going to be my storage room, right? So this would be a chest. Two, three, four, five, six, seven chest stacks that way. It needs to be at probably at least twice that. But, um, <clears throat> you know, I'm just going to get to doing it. And, uh, you know, there's uh, probably a good opportunity for a time lapse here. So, uh, here we go. this out guys I've never seen this before um, it's blowing stuff up let's take these out so they don't mess up anything no gravel out there right <laughs> no watch this this is the first time I've ever seen it if you've seen it before uh, I'm just being a derp but I've never seen this watch watch the gravel <laughs> did, did you see? It blew up and it shoved one over here. It blew it to the side. I had, uh, I guess it's like random, but um, I blew up one in this line and it 
blew them all the way out here into the room. You saw this one fly over here. That was it's kind of neat. It, it just it places a a whole block. Um, TNT can place blocks, which uh, I wonder if there's application for that. It does it quite randomly, so probably not. But hey, that's a uh, that's a neat little mechanic that I had not seen before, and I thought I'd bring back and show it. Uh, now that was fun. That was really fun. I like digging with TNT. It makes stuff so much easier. You don't have to deal with big chunks of block and yeah, just a little cleanup afterwards. And uh, and I made a big dent. This would have taken me hours if I had just dug it out. And it didn't take long at all. I had a side trip with Callie to go see her house. Um, and uh, yeah. It was a it was a good little uh, little jaunt. So uh, I think as I was digging over here, I dug under the cows. So I think what I'm going to do is actually create the cow farm. Um, I have to uh, figure out how I'm going to create the cow farm. I think it's going to be one of the ones where there's a uh, dispenser here with water in it and cows. I just want one stack of cows. I don't need four. I just want one. So it'll go... Whoa. The witches are uh, dropping in. Um, so I I don't know where I want it to come out, though. I think maybe... I'll hit and kill. And then... Uh, maybe I'll just push to kill. And it'll dispense some lava and bring it back in. Double dispenser, burn out torch type of thing. And... Um, and then the cooked beef and stuff will filter into the out here. So I need the, the chest out here because that's how I'm going to run it into the storage system eventually. Uh, and just let it... Well, maybe I can make a completely auto... No, because you've got to breed them up. So it can't be completely automated. I'm going to have to make a way into the cows probably over here um, where the witch farm is. So there'll be a witch farm here. And a cow farm here. And um, and you'll breathe them up in this room. And they will go off to die. In the other room. Mm, yeah, so that means I'm going to need a wheat farm. And oh my goodness. We've got lots of stuff to do, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Um, but I think for this episode, that's going to be it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a little more TNT mining out here uh, and extend this room out to where I have as many chests as I want. I think I'm just going to put them around the edges, starting there and come down here and then come down here and then come across there and, uh, <clears throat> and that will be the storage array. But uh, I kind of like my warehouse idea too where I come a couple across and then down this way here it could increase the number of chests depending on how far I dig out that way I could have two horseshoes right so there would be a horseshoe here and there would be a horseshoe of chests here and they would feed each other it would just go down up down you know the hopper chain I'm gonna need lots of iron and lots of hoppers um, I guess I could use water streams hmm I've never used water streams on top of a thing before. Maybe I could try that. But anyway, um, let's go ahead and call that an episode. It was probably a short one. I don't know how long I'm going to make the time lapse. And uh, I don't know how long the, uh, the episode will be at the end. But, um, hey, it's the beginning of a new season, right? So uh, we can take our time. We don't have to rush to get everything done. We can take our time and do it right. And uh, that's kind of what I want to do. Um, there's no resources to be had. No resources. I've got a couple in there as you've seen through the episode. But, uh, whoop. Don't want to fall down the stairs. So, um, yeah. We will get some more stuff done out there. This should be a much bigger room next time we meet. And, uh, and then we'll go from there. As always, ladies and gentlemen, if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like. It really helps me out. It doesn't help me out, but it, it lets me know that you're out there, and um, it keeps me creating content. 
so go ahead and hit that, smash that like button for me. Hit that like button, crush it for me, and uh, and share and favorite as you see fit, as one of my favorite YouTubers says. And uh, I am Joe BB3 from Joe BB3 Games. Thank you for joining me today. Ta.